be warm soon enough. Doesn't bother me anymore. I haven't felt anything at all for hundreds of years. Girls are so excited to meet you. It's all they've been talking about recently. You'll fit in effortlessly. How do I know? My intuition rarely fails me anymore. One of the perks of being alive for this long. Despite the circumstance in which I found you. I could feel your true nature. So this is the new member. We've been dying to get to know you. Oh, don't be nervous. You're in the right place. I'm Paulina. Lovely to meet you. Here, have some blood. They've found us a new source. She's the creature. 
creative one. Dreamer, if you will. Your paintings are fabulous. A little risque, but elegant and emotional. I'm going to go find Florence. Look who it is. It's my favorite girl. This is Luna. She's like a little sister to me. Hello. I've heard so much about you the past week. Let me just pinch your cheeks. The cheeks of a newborn are the squishiest. I still have a bit of life left in them. They are the best. Girl. I'll get ahead of ourselves here. Sorry. I'm just a hands-on kind of girl. So Raven really wasn't playing about the new member. Of course not. She'd never get our hopes up like that. I'll be back in just a minute. I'm hungry all of a sudden. Better go with her. Behave yourselves, you two. It's been so long since I've been around a newborn. I've forgotten the proper procedure. You want to hear a joke? I used to be a court jester. Jack, you are. I love it. I love everything about your beautiful name. I'm so glad you're here with us. Step aside, ladies. Can I help you get through this? Don't be so shy, you two. Come, introduce yourselves. Just call me Viv. This is Jade. She's a bit shy. Say hi. Hi. Raven told me you liked to read. Me too. Got a whole library of books upstairs. So, what are we talking about? Books? I see. I knew you would be a good addition from the moment I saw you. Such a gentle soul you have. Will you go give her a pep talk? Sorry. Jade has a horrible social anxiety. It's nothing personal. This is 
little Dracula? Do you like cats? Or a bloody new one? Suit yourselves. Hmm? We did eat. never have enough. At least I can. I could go through five humans a day and still want more. You do get carried away sometimes. I'd rather swallow a spider hole than limit my enjoyment. I know we just met, but I already adore you so much. You adore everyone? New emotions are always going to feel better than stale ones. More than anything, I'm just so glad you don't have to go through this stage alone like I did. Me too. I'm glad we found you when we did. That could have been a disaster. It'll get easier to deal with your own might even decide you like being a vampire. I know I do. But I remember not liking it at first. So I have so much empathy for you. We're almost out of blood up here. Would you mind getting us more from the basement? This environment can really suck the life out of you if you're not used to it. This is what happens when a bunch of introverts get comfortable around each other. Of course, we always take care of our own. So much safer to be in here than it is to be out there. Trust me, she's right. Despite your new senses and gray strength, you're still just a party of one. But now that you're you need some fresh air, there's a gorgeous balcony upstairs. It's the best place to watch the sunrise. The air is so fresh and crisp this time of year. Not that that would appeal to you. Very normal to be this cold. Jade gave up her room by the ovens for you. It's nice and warm in there. Now, she does like you. She's just very shy in groups, but one on one. Well, why don't you go find out? She's right over there. Hi. 
sure. I remember the chills from when I was a newborn. Feels icy all over. You should have it, at least for a few months. Besides, I've already moved all my things out. Yeah, just do another room in the compound. Sorry if I gave you the wrong impression. I get kind of shy in groups. And I was especially nervous to meet you. Because... Well, from Raven's description, sounded wonderful. And she was right. When I first got here, I had a really hard time fitting in. But you seemed to be doing Sometimes it's hard to go with the flow. You have an eyelash on your cheek. May I? Never done that before. When you lose an eyelash, you're supposed to blow it off your finger and make a wish. I know this place can be kind of intimidating. But more so with all the things going on inside of you. Big life changes. And I want you to know that you're not alone. Mostly like to keep to myself. But if you ever get scared or have a panic attack in the middle of the night, something like that, I want you to know that I'm here. So is little Dracula. 
She loves cats. If you leave your door open a little bit, he may come to see you tonight. He loves that. Why don't I go show you? 